In this multi-step conversion, Raldo measures a room at 9 feet long by 10 feet wide. He wants to get an area measurement for carpet. So he finds that 9 feet times 10 feet is 90 square feet. That's the area of the room. So if he puts carpet in the room, carpet is measured usually in square yards. He knows that one yard is equivalent to three feet. So he divides 90 by 3 and gets 30 and orders 30 square yards of carpet. Does he order the correct amount? So what we're trying to find out here in this case is 90 square feet, which we can write as 90 SQFT, that's one way to write that, is how many square yards. And this type of conversion can be a little confusing because it seems like Raldo did the right thing. One yard is three feet, so he divided 90 by three to get square yards. So let's see if that really does work. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to write this in a little bit of an extended form with the units. So 90 square feet is 90, and there are two instances of feet, and they're multiplied. So it's 90 feet times feet. So if I want to change the feet to yards, I'm going to have to include two conversions. So one yard is three feet. That will convert the first set of feet. And I have to do this again. One yard is three feet. That will help us convert the second set. So there go my feet. And what I have is 90, if I multiply across, 90 times 1 times 1 is 90, over 3 times 3, which is 9, and my units are square yards. So if I divide 90 by 9, I get 10 square yards. So 90 square feet is 10 square yards. Raldo ordered 3 times too much carpeting three times the amount that he needed. He should have ordered 10 square yards.